An extreme solar storm recently struck Earth, and while it raised concerns over potential disruptions to power and communications, it also sparked a rare and spectacular celestial light show. With northern lights visible from Tasmania to Britain and Canada to the United States, the skies were lit with colors usually unseen by residents in these areas. Sean O'Riordan captured the moment in Tasmania, stating, Absolutely biblical skies at 4 a.m. this morning. I had to desaturate the colors, clouds glowing red, insane. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration issued a severe geomagnetic storm warning following the solar outburst's arrival on Earth. The storm's effects are expected to last through the weekend and possibly into the next week. Power plant operators, spacecraft in orbit, and the Federal Emergency Management Agency were alerted to take precautions. Rob Steenberg, a scientist with NOAA's Space Weather Prediction Center, reassured the public, saying, For most people here on planet Earth, they won't have to do anything. The storm's reach was vast, with northern lights seen as far south in the U.S. as Ohio, across Canada, and even in Scotland's Hartford. In Germany, Switzerland, and Oceania, social media buzzed with Aurora images. Ian Mansfield from Hartford, England, shared his family's excitement. We've just woken the kids to go watch the northern lights in the back garden, clearly visible with the naked eye. While the storm provides a visual treat, it also poses risks to high-voltage transmission lines for power grids and could affect satellites, disrupting navigation and communication services. Previous storms have caused power outages and damaged equipment, as seen in Sweden and South Africa in 2003. Even wildlife, such as pigeons, may be impacted as their internal biological compasses become unreliable during geomagnetic storms. This storm is part of increased solar activity as the sun approaches the peak of its 11-year cycle. The sun has been producing strong solar flares, resulting in multiple outbursts of plasma. This activity is associated with a large sunspot, 16 times the diameter of Earth. Despite the potential risks, NASA has stated that the astronauts aboard the International Space Station are not in serious danger. Mike Betwee, operations chief for the Prediction Center, encourages everyone to snap a picture of the sky, and there might be actually a nice little treat there for you.